Hello and welcome. Today we are going to install Brew, or more accurately, Homebrew. We have a fresh Ubuntu 22.04 LTS install, fully updated. And Homebrew is the self build missing package manager for Mac OS or Linux. Um, a, lot of the, a lot of the time when you're trying out different tools and frameworks and whatnot, uh, you're going to hit requirements that are pretty low level and hard to deal with depending on which system you're on. Homebrew makes that easier, um, streamlines packages for, for, for all, this, uh, all this stuff I'm talking about. So let's just go ahead and install it. I like to go get the latest and greatest right from the horse's mouth at brew.sh. And it says we must install git first. So let's go for it. sudo app install git enter. Yes. And we'll let that go. Now, up arrow a couple times. Enter. Enter. It is installing itself in dot Linux home Linux brew dot Linux brew. While it's doing that, let's go ahead and open another tab. And if we check where we are, we are in slash home slash Russian. Russell. Let's go back to direct or one directory. And there's Linux brew. It's empty other than the dot Linux brew directory which will contain a bin and stuff like that. All the good innards that you don't care about and don't want to care about. We'll go ahead and let that go. Okay, homebrew is installed and it's telling us the next steps. Run these three commands in your terminal to add homebrew to your path. So let's go ahead and copy, pasto, entre. We got it. Install homebrew's dependencies if you have sudo access. We do. So we are going to install build essentials. And we lost what we're doing. Next step, brew install GCC. That will be the test of brew itself. How are we doing? Okay, now that is finished. Let's go ahead and try to install brew install GCC. I mean run brew install GCC. All right, it's working. Yay. Let it do it. Let it do its thing, which is downloading files and putting them in its Linux brew directory where it will symlink or make a shortcut into the main system directory so no matter where you are, you can run it. But it's Homebrew has now poured its cask or whatever terminology it uses. GCC is theoretically installed and it works. It sends us an error because we're not actually sending it anything, but there you have it. Homebrew is installed and we can continue next time.